Hi Dresser Cuties, Wayne here. Today we're going to draw a mermaid frost drink. So let's get started. To draw this very cool drink, let's first start by drawing the lip of our cup. So I'm going to come right here and draw a small little curve. And I'm going to go all the way across as if I'm drawing an oval. And I'm just going to curve all the way to say about right here. Just nice and wide cup. So I just want to create the lip of our cup. Now that we have that curve in, let's go ahead and we're going to thicken it up, come around, and go ahead and just follow your top. So this part is very delicate, <laughs> so take your time to draw this part. Okay, so now that I have the lip of my drink in my cup, let's come in onto the sides right here and same thing over here. So I just work on one side first. I just figure out my angle on one side. So I'll just bring this down. It's all up to you how big you want your drink to be. So let's say about right here. And then a little more. So let's say about right here is where I'm going to stop. And let's draw the other side. So once again, just another little tip. Use this point, go straight up to about right here. So you know it's about this distance. And then you can just kind of eyeball it. So about right here. And bring down another point to about right here on the same level as that. Then from there, it's just a little bit easier. It won't be perfect, but it just makes it a little bit easier to draw this angle to make it match the other side a little bit better. There. Okay, not too bad, right? And then let's round off the bottom right here and connect. So hopefully that tip helps you. There. And then on the bottom of this uh, cup right here, I'm going to put in a little notch. So right here, I'm just going to draw another light curve at the bottom for those cups. And then we just notch it in, bring it in right here. Okay, so then now that we have that, let's go ahead and draw the best part of this drink. I'm going to stick a mermaid tail right here. So I'm going to start about in this area. I'll just go ahead and just draw a curve about right here, just following that curve. And I'm going to go up and curve. And then right here, draw another one coming right into this curve I've created. Then let's see here, let's draw the tail. So I'm going to go out and Round off the tip and bring it right back to the center. And another one on the other side. Round off the tip and bring it right back. And then for some details, you can come right here lightly and draw a curve. And you can do this when you're coloring so it's not a harsh black line, but you can just draw these lines right here for some detail. Bring this in. Give our tail some texture and then you can draw these curves. So like I said, you can just do this when you're coloring. Stagger. There, so that just gives our tail some texture. Okay, so then now that we have that, let's surround this top part with some cream. So. I go up right here and I'm just going to aim towards the center. So I'll just go ahead and just draw this side first coming in. And about right here, I'll come in overlapped by my tail, come out and right there, round it off and just bring it in. So then just imagine this is coming out on this side. So I'm going to come right here, just like the other side, two and three. There, okay. So now I know, let's fill 
move this up. And then now that I have that in, we can just lightly draw a line. So we have layers of this cream on the top. And to decorate it even more, let's um, add a little star right here. A sea star. Because we're trying to make it like an ocean theme, right? Of course. And maybe like even a little shell right here to decorate. And add a bunch of circles. Whatever you like to decorate this. And let's see here. I'm going to pop this out a little bit more. Make it a little bit fuller. Okay, and then of course, let's draw a straw. So I'm going to put a straw in about right here. Round off the top and bring it down. And let's just add some stripes. There. And now to uh, make it a draw so cute mermaid uh, frost slush smoothie drink. I'm not sure what it is, but I just really love this idea of having a mermaid drink with all the blues and aqua. So that was just the uh, inspiration for this. So let's come about right here. So you can make your drink however you like. You call it whatever you like, I mean. So, put a circle here for a draw so cute eye and say about right here, draw another one. Oops. Okay, so now my circle's in. Let's put in two smaller circles for highlights and a curved line at the bottom and shade in the top. And lines at the bottom and same thing over here. And since this is a mermaid drink, let's give this eye some lashes, right? <laughs> and let's draw a soft curve above each eye. And of course, a smile in between with a tongue sticking out because it's extra yum. Then cap it off. And that is pretty much it for the drink. So when you're coloring this part, you can create a gradation from the different blues to the greens or aquas. And right about here, you can just add like a little wave of white maybe to separate the top from the bottom. But I definitely don't want to do that with my Sharpie because it'd be just really harsh. We can just create this little wave at the top. And that is pretty much it. I really hope you love this drink uh, just as much as all the other drinks I've drawn so far. Thanks so much for watching. And if you loved it, please make sure to give me a like and subscribe so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.